Moment of truth. Today will be the second day in the new shop. It's so weird going in there not seeing Jake the Toilet Snake. Jake the Toilet Snake was the man. I used to always reminisce with him every time I came here. Not no more, I got a new job. On yesterday's upload, I think I confused a couple people. Now I don't have any desks or anything. So I gotta use this simple chair that's actually my landlord's. So yesterday's video, I was extremely excited. I, I finally revealed my new space to you guys, so I was extremely pumped. And, and I'm sorry that some of you guys took that the wrong way, that I'm you know, acting like a different individual. And I completely understand. I, I get energetic when I like things, and I like a lot of things, because without liking a lot of things, life kind of sucks. Second thing was, people didn't understand that I had a garage door. I have a huge garage door. It's a 12 by 10 foot garage door. How do you not see that? Two things that you guys started worrying me about. In life, you always want to have your priorities straight. Now for me, my priorities are... One. Fun. And number two. I almost forgot how to spell it. That says work. Now Dalton, why do you have work on the bottom and fun on top? Well, here's the thing. Without fun, work is not enjoyable. And without work, fun just, it, it isn't gonna happen. Now this isn't a law because some things don't follow this procedure, like for example, life. Life is free. And, and a lot of the times we take it for granted because it's free. But objects, objects usually need work in order to buy or to trade or to get. Now a lot of people have it the other way around where they gotta have work, work on top and then fun on the bottom. The truth is for me it's actually work and fun is on the same plane. And this is how we get to the premise of the vlog. Today we are going to install a rock wall. I, I should be working on, you know, setting up a workbench or, or setting up tools or setting up some organization or getting rid of this echo that continues to screw up my audio. But no, I'm not gonna do that and I'll explain it in a second. Here is today's handy dandy workbench. And if you looked really closely to the box that I brought in today, it's actually got a lens on it. And I'll explain a little bit more about that in a second as well. <laughs> I don't mean to do that, I just need to tell my story correctly, otherwise it doesn't work. This is my homemade projector. I don't have a projector, I don't own a projector. I don't wanna go out and buy a projector because it would take two or three days to get in. I'll just make my own or try to make my own and then we'll go from there. The only problem is I don't know if this is going to work. I want to put something on this wall. <laughs> I, I gotta turn off the lights for this. Wow, that actually looks really good. Really well. Not only is my new device a projector, but it's also a transformer. I'm totally kidding. My projector didn't work at all. This thing, no. So I had to pick this thing up. I've marked everything. You can't see everything. I have to now go over it with pencil and trace it all out. I, I made it so that I can connect each edge and uh, I'll show you in a second. An hour of hustle and energy and we get this. That looks awesome. Machine is my new brand, like 3D machines. For you guys that don't know, 3D is actually my initials, so it's Dalton D Daily. And then at the time, machines just meant like toys and dirt bikes and four wheelers and things like that. But now, it means something totally different. And what I mean by that is, everybody is a machine that watches this channel. Like it used to be machine freaks, but, but now you're just a machine. Like machines go the extra mile. So I'm a machine, you guys are machines. Like anybody could have just bought a decal and, and slapped it up in 30 seconds. They didn't have to run around and go get a projector. They didn't have to you know, paint that little tiny detail with a paintbrush. Whether you're a money making machine, a sleep machine, a dream machine, you're a machine. If you're on this channel and you put in the time and energy and the hustle to make a life better and more fun. I made it back to my other garage. 
I got an awesome idea for that wall. Not, not just my new brand or my new logo, but something a little bit more fun. It looks like fun to me. Jeez! I am going to semi-automate this process. exactly one month since I had my dirt bike accident and my wrist still hurts. It only hurts like 5% when I tweak it a certain way, but still it's been a whole month and it still hurts. It, it kind of sucks. And the reason why I bring this up is because, well, I didn't really listen to the doctor when I went to go see the doctor after I had my crash and uh, he said uh, wrap it up and then take ibuprofen. I didn't listen to either one of those things. I didn't wrap it, I didn't take ibuprofen. I don't know if I'm really a fan of medication. I would rather have my body and my immune system take care of anything and uh, maybe because of that it's not healing up properly or even maybe if I did wrap this up and then I did take the ibuprofen that everything would be a-okay. -okay. But there are no what ifs. So instead I am going to give myself my own physical therapy. That should be a good start. And now literally all I have to do is go on the other side of the wall and then put these things in. I, I drilled the wrong hole, but it's funny because uh, these things aren't even doing their job right now. And I mean, <laughs> I can't pull that thing off the wall. Okay, so now that the first one's up, I will actually show you what needs to be done to get it to that point. Grab the right drill bit. Take this spiky thing, go on the other side of the wall and hammer this into the hole. Then put your bolt and the washer right through there. Send that sucker through your wall. Okay, I've done the easy level, now it's time to move on to the expert level. Moment of truth. This was a fantastic idea, a wonderful idea, a beautiful idea, and it's great physical therapy. Wrist is doing really good right now. I told you guys yesterday, this wall was going to be something just like that, 24 hours, we did it. It's a lot of fun, it's a lot of physical activity, which is really, really good for the body and the soul. I'm out of breath and I can mean, already feel the toxins leaving my body. I'll leave a link to these rocks in my description. They'd be a good birthday present, they'd be a good Christmas present, they'd be a good just toy. There are 25 pieces in this kit. Don't buy eBay specials, you'll end up with tiny little rocks that you can't grab hold of. These things are not gonna go anywhere. I, I wanna get into shape and you need to put yourself through some physical abuse. I mean, you gotta work out from time to time to get the brain juices flowing, to get the body juices flowing. So not only are these things going to fix my wrist and make me a stronger and better and more creative person, but man, they look good on that wall. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this 3D Machines production. Until next time, become a machine, get in on the action. If you haven't already subscribed, consider subscribing. Things are gonna get crazy on this channel. See you tomorrow! Don't stay inside the lines. Get out of the lines. Unless you're tracing stuff, then stay inside the lines, otherwise it doesn't look as good.